All right, Coach, can you just describe this moment of having one of your players get selected to an All-Star game like this? Uh, it's a very prestigious moment, you know, for one of our student athletes to achieve this here at Ann Arbor here in high school. I think it's the first All-American in the history of the school. Um, great young man. Um, you know, it's great to be a part of this and witness this and be able to help mentor Adam along the way as well. Um, he's, Michigan is getting a high character young man has morals, values, and a high character family. You know, he's a very respectful young man. You know, it's just a great moment for our student athletes and it definitely paves the way for other student athletes to work hard to be able to, you know, to see this young man work, you know, for his craft and be rewarded, you know. So it's a great honor for the school and for that young man and his family. When did it hit you that you had a pretty high profile kicker? I mean, was it freshman year? Was it a certain kick in the game? Was it practice? Well, like, when I would say you? freshman year, just to see his work ethic. I mean, like I'm saying, I was very honest. I would ride by, he wouldn't know I was coming up to the field, but you know, I, we have no days off here. So, you know, I would ride by, see him out on a Saturday, early afternoon after a basketball game on a Friday night and you know Adam would be out there kicking his dad be freezing cold you know and so <laughs> I knew that this guy was serious about his craft you know um, so hey he just worked at it and that's the thing you know a lot of student athletes need to understand if you work at your craft you will perfect it and get better and that young man is perfectionist you know he pushes himself he gets up at himself he gets upset at himself and misses certain kicks and he just works and works and works. He don't leave the field until he makes that kick. I, You know, it's kind of tough trying to coach a kicker, but where would you say he needs to keep on improving the most with his game? I think the biggest thing, I won't say improvement, but the biggest thing I think to enjoy it and have fun is where I want him to see, enjoy the game. I think. You know, at times, he's such a perfectionist, it's just tough for him at times, you know, so he likes to be perfect. And, you know, he needs to understand that, you know, no one's perfect, you know, things happen. But that that's where I want to see him, you know, improve at just, you know, have fun, enjoy it while he's doing it, you know. So I wouldn't say, I think, you know, as far as the improvement, he's going to do the things that he needs to do internally to improve the stuff that, you know, his coaches ask of him. But I just want to see him enjoy the game. You know, enjoy the moment. Obviously, he's committed to Michigan. Can you talk about that fit? I mean, is it a perfect fit? Like, how do you think about that fit of him going to Michigan? For him, you know, for me, you know, talking to the family and talking with uh, the coaching staff at Michigan, he's been wanting to put on that blue helmet since he can put on a helmet, you know, a, a, a maze and blue, you know, helmet uh, and uniform. So for him, it's the right fit. It's a dream come true for him, him and his family. Um, it was no other place for him but Michigan. You know, we have everybody that walked through the school to recruit our student athletes. And, you know, he would speak just out of it to be respectful, but, you know, he was go blue all the way. So, <laughs> so it's a great fit for him. He's going to make sure he does everything to be able to represent the university with high prestige, you know. And so he's going to go in there and do what he's supposed to do. And he's going to compete. That's one thing about him. He has another competitive nature. He's just not a kicker. You know, we didn't want to you know, see anything happen to his leg, but he can play receiver, safety. I mean, he's one of the most athletic kickers in the country. You know, Michigan, right down the road for you guys. Uh, during the evaluation period, I'm assuming a coach or two stopped through the school. Uh, what coaches stopped by, and I guess, how's your relationship with the coaching staff? Like, what do you think of the Michigan coaching staff? Oh, they're great. They're amazing. You know, they're open, honest, great evaluations. Um, I'm in constant communication with those guys. They stopped by, you know, Coach Hart stopped by just to say hi and come, you know, to visit with me and, you know, have conversations. You know, I talk with Coach Harbaugh and defensive coordinator, you know, on the phone and just, just good, good, great dialogue. You know, those guys are great. They're great for the kids. They build relationships. They care about their student athletes. So, you know, Michigan has the right staff there. You know, they're, they're great. Coach Bellamy is a great guy. Their phone is always open, they, they communicate, you know, so, I mean, I'm happy with the things that they're doing and the in-state recruiting that they're doing, as well as nationally. You know, it's a great staff. Just last thing, when you see them on Saturdays in the big house or wherever, I guess, kicking up field goal, maybe it's a game winner or something like that, what, what's going to be going through your head seeing when your former players out there in a high-pressure situation from all these people, too? Um, 
he's built different. That's why I'm thinking he's built different. He's been waiting for this moment. That's what he wants. You know, he wants the pressure, the stress. He's built different. That guy, <laughs> he will not fold. He's going to work. He's going to work at pressure kicks. I mean, in practice, we do crazy little kicks all the time. When I'm running by him, yelling, screaming, and from 50 yards, and he's like, hey, coach, you know I love the pressure. You know, and he kicks the ball, makes the field goal. And so, hey, he, he wants that pressure. So I hope it is a time that it comes down to him, you know, um, to be great. I think he has the ability to do those things. His mindset, he's a strong kid. He has a strong mindset. So he's going to do well there. I think it's going to be a great fit for Michigan. Appreciate the time, coach. No problem.